some people say geography is what geographers do because it's such an eclectic discipline, um, which is one of the reasons why I got interested in geography. But geography is known as an integrative science. Um, it's a study that incorporates a variety of perspectives, but ultimately looking at the nature of the planet, um, the inhabitation of the planet. I love knowing a little bit about every subject. And with geography, I can learn about so many different disciplines, history, biology, ecology, the environment, sociology, anthropology. Geography brings them all together. and looks at the interaction between people and place. We're the great borrowers. Uh, we borrow from sociology, from uh, psychology, from uh, anthropology, from history. <clears throat> We're, we, and we take all these things and then try and explain things in a spatial, in a spatial text, uh, the spatial context, where things are happening, why they're happening, where they are, and how they move from place to place. Geography students and, and people who, who intend to become professional geographers would find employment in areas that conform generally to their interest areas. People who are interested in physical geography, environmental geography, find work in areas ranging from national park systems and recreation management to environmental impact assessment, um, water resource management, uh, all, all sorts of related fields. Geography gives us a sense of what the Earth looks like in terms of both natural characteristics like continents, oceans, mountains, and rivers, as well as man-made designations such as countries, counties, and cities. But it also explores the impact physical environments have on the way people live. In physical geography, we study the surface of the Earth and the landscapes of the Earth. We study the rivers, the mountains, how they got to be there. All the physical features on the Earth are all part of physical geography, as well as the distribution of biological species like trees or other animals and plants. Physical geography also looks at hazards, earthquakes, volcanoes, and how they impact people. Cultural geography focuses on people. We look at the religions, the food that people eat, the clothes that they wear, what they do for work, and just their typical daily activities and life activities, and their different folk ways. With the internet and with global telecommunication technology, you can communicate with Pakistan instantaneously now. So you need to be aware of the culture and the society of Pakistan, and that's what geographers do. We study regions around the world. You need to know what's going on in Pakistan and how changes in political events in other countries and other areas around the world affect us today. <laughs> 